Hey everyone, and welcome back to the galaxy. Today, we will be using the normal map filter to create an almost acid trip-like appearance to our photos. I've found that this effect works best on landscape photos, and I've chosen one for my project. To start, we are going to go up to Filters, Generic, down to Normal Map. This filter analyzes the depth of the photo, almost like you're looking at a 3D map. It analyzes the color information and creates dips and protrusions in the photograph. This can help us accentuate actual depth of the photo and bring out highs and amplify lows, almost giving our photographs the appearance of 3D dimension. We can reverse these dips and protrusions by experimenting with the Flip X and Flip Y options. Notice how as I click Flip Y, some of these deeper areas in the sky flip to appear more outward facing. We can make these areas more pronounced by editing the scale slider. Now let's see how this affects our photograph. We are going to click the Mode dropdown and change it to LCH Chroma. If I click Split View, you can already see the difference this has made in our photograph. Colors are brighter, and we get some awesome different artifacts back here. Now, you can adjust these settings to see how they affect your photograph until you get an appearance you are happy with. Also experiment with the other blending modes to create equally cool effects, like overlay. Which preserves more of the color information in the original photo. And if we use split view, you can see how the appearance of these mountains almost becomes 3D. And that's it. You now know how to use the normal map filter to create an acid-like appearance on your photographs. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, consider subscribing for more awesome content. Let us know if you found this tutorial helpful by liking this video and leaving us a comment. Thanks for watching.